Our first Classics Uncorked concert of the season is a program that I have been really looking forward to for a long time. I'm very excited about it. It's called Made in America, and it's a program that's a celebration, really, of the legacy of American music and a journey through what was the American century in music in so many ways, the 20th century. It's hard to sum up the American symphonic sound because American composers just inhabited such a wide range of sound worlds. But most American composers do share at least a few different characters in common. First, a commitment to rhythm and Many of the pieces on the program have these pulse-pounding rhythms that really just get inside you and have you tapping your foot and bouncing up and down in your seat. Also, a use of jazz, combining the jazz sound, which is such an important part of the American tradition in music, with the classical symphonic orchestral sound. The program will feature some familiar, well-loved classics, Leonard Bernstein's symphonic dances from West Side Story, selections from George Gershwin's Porgy and Bess, also Aaron Copland's Fanfare for the Common Man, which is particularly appropriate because this year's concert is falling on September 11th. One of our goals of the Kansas City Symphony is to bring every single audience member closer to the music and to the musicians, and Classics Uncorked is a great way to do that. You really get the chance to get inside the music as you sit in Hellsberg Hall and then to get closer to the musicians over a glass of wine out in the lobby after the concert. We really hope we see everybody at Made in America. That's 7 p.m. in Hellsberg Hall on September 11th. See you there.